I'm from Philadelphia, born and raised. I was educated in the Philadelphia School District. Um, right now I work at the University of Pennsylvania and the Penn Center for Minority Serving Institutions. My path to Cheney started with my parents. I, I guess by definition, I'm a second generation college student. Both my parents attended university. I was an average student, but I knew because of my parents, college was the next logical choice. Cheney just was the better fit for me. It had what I wanted. They gave me the support that I needed, but they also gave me financial support. So. Um, coming in as a Keystone Honor student, I didn't have to take out a loan, so it just made more sense for me to come to Cheney. So I'm a class of 2017 graduate. Uh, immediately after leaving Cheney, I took a position with the Kellogg Company, where I came on as a sales representative. Uh, since then, I have transitioned to a new company, so now I'm a sales representative with Kraft Heinz. I think what's most interesting about my story is, initially college wasn't in the plans for me. So my junior year of high school, I transferred to a school in Philadelphia called Emotep Charter, um, where I was able to develop uh, a network of mentors and advisors uh, who really stressed the importance of college or college education, uh, most of which were Cheney alumni. Um, so I had a lot of people around me who showed me the success after college and what that would be like. And from that point, I knew that Cheney was kind of the home for me. In high school, I was a good student, but not a great student, and so it was like I kind of floated in the middle. But coming to Cheney, I was labeled as a scholar. So from like day one, that reaffirmations and affirmations that you can do it gave me confidence, and it, it felt to me that Cheney valued me and made a commitment to me. I felt the support like immediately. Um, I think my first contact at Cheney uh, had to be student relations. Uh, so Ms. Thorne was a big impact in my four years here. Uh, from there, uh, I met Dr. Turnipseed, who heads the hospitality program, and uh, we were close for the entire four years. He, he's had a major part of my success as well. So working with my mentors here, um, Dr. Wesley Plummer, um, Dr. Tara Kent, helped shape my identity around career and education. I had a major in business management and a minor in tourism. Uh, and what that did was it helped me to participate in a number of internships. In fact, I had six in internships while I was here at Cheney in addition to a study abroad. I came in as a business major, but over the course of my time and like my experience at Cheney, it kind of pushed me back towards education. So going through the business department and being involved in so many activities on campus, I kind of found my niche in higher education. The confidence really came from being challenged to lead here at Cheney, whether in a classroom or just in the general campus community. I was always challenged to lead. I think that I got the entire collegiate experience. I was involved in almost every collegiate activity that you could think of on campus, but I, I credit Cheney for giving me that opportunity and giving me that support that let me know that I could do it. I would definitely say that my degree holds weight. I, I think once you transition into the workforce, it's not so much where you, where you attended school, but really how much experience you have and your ability to apply it to whatever you're going to be doing. I think um, the education I received at Cheney University definitely stacks up against um, other schools and other institutions because it prepared me not only inside the classroom but outside of the classroom. If I could offer any advice to prospective students um, or current students, it would be to be present. I think that presence plays a big role in your ability to achieve success.